punches. That's the pit's known for. Chuck Liddell's old home. Touch of gloves. Nijin and southpaw stance. Nijin fighting out of many modern kickboxing. Chuck kicks. It's going straight for work. You see uh, Sutherland going for a double leg. Total surprise. I thought Sutherland would be coming in with the heavy strikes, and he ends up um, going in for a double leg. Nijin needs to get an underhook right here. He needs to get a wizard on one side. He's got the underhook on another. He's going to get dumped. And he stops the dump. Nice hooks. Now he needs to come around with his right arm and, and overhook that other side and or work for a pummel. So he's only working ribs a little bit. He might want to throw a knee right here. And he should shoot a knee right there. Yep, that's a great shot. Here. Nigel's doing a nice job of defense here. It just reads more relaxed than he is right here. Just like, okay, whatever. Yeah. Right. My ring just <laughs> pointed out to me is my knife in his win. I am so silly some days. I hit him in the cover a lot. 31 full fights. Oh, no, no need to Everybody butchers this last win. Oh, I feel silly. All right, Mr. Win, I apologize to you and your family that's just watching. I'm going to get a quick dump. He works with the dump. Win got a good team in. He's touching it up. He got a single leg wrap with a good team. I don't know how deep this is. Something is not defending. He should be hand fighting that. He's just scoring some punches. Remember earlier how I told you about letting go of a submission, you don't got it, and then working the position? That's what just occurred right there. He realized he's got it, doesn't got it, so he let go before he lost position. Bad position. He comes up to a wizard and comes up to his feet. Sutherland's gonna lock his hands and look for another dump. Wynn does a great job right there of splitting his and um, stopping that from occurring. Oh, he's gonna get dumped officially. Wynn should have went for a little bit of a cross face. It happens. The third fight on the pro side of this car, folks. What an exciting night it's been so far. So cool. Wins underneath, up kicking. Sutherland's putting the pressure. You hear uh, Sutherland's corner yelling for an elbow. I mean, I was expecting Sutherland to come out heavy handed like most guys do, but he came out and went straight into more grappling, which is surprising. Uh, let's see, Sutherland, under his commentary, says he is a balanced fighter, which uh, drops him some nice, little, nice elbows. Now, folks, you might think those elbows aren't too bad, but when you bring your weight down, you got gravity on top, dropping those popping, popping, those add up. They add up, especially when you get them up there around the forehead, cranial area, where you're bouncing your brain around. That's your brain up and it's really easy to get cuts on that too. Wind needs to well, Wind's going to get TKO'd right here, and that's it. And Sutherland sticks his game plan, gets the, the, the TKO. What a turnaround there. Uh -huh. He did a great job, I mean. Ladies and gentlemen, give her a yeah, round yeah. of applause. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good thing. This welterweight division matchup comes to a stop by the referee in the first round. We got TKO for your winner, Jimmy Hamburg!